Hello there, everybody. I'm meteorologist Cassie Nall, and for our Tuesday, the bottom line is keep the umbrellas handy. We're already seeing the scattered showers and storms on and off around the Sun Coast, and the heavier rain is going to be moving in a little bit later today. We've got a frontal boundary that's making its way down through the southeast, moving very, very slowly, and it has a lot of moisture to work with. That's why locally heavy rainfall is a big concern with this system. We could see over two to three inches of rain in some locations, which could cause some standing water in those low-lying or poor drainage areas. And along with the heavy rain, some of the thunderstorms associated with this front could be on the stronger side, producing gusty winds and frequent lightning as well. Again, the heavier stuff will be moving in a little bit later today and will last through the overnight hours and into the first half of our Wednesday, too. Though our highs today should still be able to reach the upper 70s and the lower 80s. You won't see temperatures this warm, though until probably early next week, because once that front comes through, it is going to really cool us down here just in time for our Thanksgiving holiday. Now that moisture associated with the system is actually being drawn up all the way from the eastern Pacific, all the way up through the Gulf of Mexico, providing the heavy rain for us, up the east coast, and into the mid-Atlantic and the northeast. And that's why tr that's going to be our travel trouble spot for tomorrow. I know it's one of the biggest travel holidays of the entire year. And for D.C., Baltimore, into Boston, New York, Philadelphia, all of those areas can expect delays and cancellations due to not only heavy rain, rain, but a wintry mix, gusty winds, and even some heavy snowfall. So heads up if you're traveling up and down the eastern seaboard tomorrow. This is going to cause a messy travel situation. And for us, again, the rain is going to last into the first half of our Wednesday. But behind that front, we are going to feel very breezy, very cool northerly winds, bringing that chilly air on down here to the sun coast. So here's how it's looking now for your seven-day forecast. Again, the heavier rain, the more consistent rain, starts later today. And the showers and the thunderstorms will last into the first half of our Wednesday. Temperatures are going to start off in the morning in the 60s, and that's where they're going to stay before they begin to drop behind that front all the way down into the middle and upper 40s for the start of our Thanksgiving morning. That's a heads up for those turkey trotters out there. But we should have plenty of sunshine getting up into the upper 60s during the afternoon, still cool and breezy. And from there, a warming trend begins with beautiful weather ahead as we go into the weekend for the Sun Coast. Now you'll want to stay tuned to SNN for the very latest with your forecast. You can do that 24 hours a day, 7 days a week on the channels listed there on your screen. Have a happy and a safe Tuesday.